This land has witnessed several civilizations, from the mythical Tartessus to the Al-Andalus. It is also one of the most important ecological reserves in Europe. In 1964, José Antonio Valverde founded the Doñana Biological Reserve as a natural laboratory to study ecology and evolution. The Doñana Biological Station, EBD, was then created as a new center of the Spanish Research Council. The first headquarters of the EBD were in a couple of rented houses in the civilian neighborhood of Heliopolis. The EBD soon became a reference for conservation biology. In 1984, the Institute moved to a historical building of the Hispano-American World Exhibition, the Peruvian Pavilion. At this stage, its science matured. Several new laboratories, such as the Molecular Ecology Laboratory, were created. Similarly, new areas of research, such as the study of plant-animal interactions, started to gain important recognition worldwide. Again, this fast growth required a new home for the centre. In 2009, the Institute moved to a brand new building in the technological park of La Isla de la Cartuja, outside Seville, where it is today. The EBD has also grown in quality. Many papers are regularly published in the top interdisciplinary journals such as Nature, Science and PNAS. Several of its scientists are world-class leaders in fields such as conservation, genetics and theoretical ecology. In 2012, the EBD became a Severo Ochoa Center of Excellence. Today, we face an unprecedented rate of change. The big challenge is producing a more predictive science which can serve to guide us in a period of major turmoil. The EBD, with an international personnel conducting interdisciplinary research, is ready to keep evolving. The most exciting years are surely yet to come.